सेकंड ओपन दिस आई एम नॉट अ ब्यूटी गुरु और एनीथिंग आई ऐसे टिप्स से बड़े-बड़े दे रही हूं मैं सिर्फ ये बड़ा पता व्हाट फॉर गोल्ड तो व्हाट डू यू सी आई सी दिस आई सी दिस हैपनिंग इन लाइक वीडियोस एंड आई एम सो फास्ट आई कांट बिलीव आई एम डूइंग दिस टुडे हाय पिंक विला दिस इज एहसास एंड टुडे यू आर गोना गेट रेडी विद मी I have literally grown up watching Get Ready videos, uh, and it really interests me. I I'm very intrigued with what everyone in the world, from across the world, do with their skin and how they do their makeup. And I take tips from that. And then if I like a product, I look, I go on Google and I search, and I'm like, "Ye mujhe chahiye." Then wo milta nahi ho baat lagya. So I woke up in the morning and I iced my face. I took a big bowl. I put a lot of ice in it and a lot of water, and I dipped my face into it. uh it was intense it is really painful but i think it's the best thing that you can do to your skin uh because it really wakes you up and i'm a person who who wakes up with like a bloat fish face i'm always puffy even at like 3 3 o'clock in the afternoon i have like puffy eyes puffy face i it's just very annoying so that is something that really helps me uh i'm going to start with sunscreen this is dot and key sunscreen this is the best sunscreen i've ever used this is so lightweight so i just this is how i put sunscreen i put a lot of it on my hand i rub it and then i just dab okay one tip you should always take your rings off because it will hurt you on your face so yeah do that always this is one tip that my mom gave me i think when i was like 7 8 years old ki because i was doing like this one day and she's like aise nahi karte hain aise aapki skin niche sag hone lagegi it's always upwards always upwards so that has always stayed with me so anyone any time i see someone else doing this i'm also like aise nahi karte upwards upwards and always remember your neck i saw a meme the other day where <laughs> this woman is like fully really pretty from here and all of this is like wrinkled and tanned because people always forget their neck so always the neck as well i'm not a beauty guru or anything i'm just tips se bade bade de rahi hu aise ye bada pata hai so yeah always the neck this is it this is my first step and then i go um uh, there's a sunscreen for lips as well guys i recently discovered it and it's awesome This is Alana. Uh it has SPF 40 and it it also comes with like a tint and it's lip glossy and it looks really nice so I'm always wearing this and it's also like sun protection it's crazy. So I put a little bit of this before my makeup. And another tip that I got was that wear sunscreen half an hour before you get out because it takes at least half an hour for the sunscreen to start working. So yeah so this is what I do before my makeup and also then I go into my moisturizer iska naam I don't know how to pronounce so this is really good this is uh, this is actually my third bottle this is an amazing this my makeup artist suggested and I've seen a lot of makeup artists use this it's amazing so again the same thing you rub it on your palms and then you blend it because this is not how you want to look on the moisturizer I don't know what my skin type is sometimes it's dry sometimes it's oily I think it's a combination I I grew up with a lot of acne on my face which is why you will still see a little um, spots I still get acne I'm, I I we are supposed to get acne I'm 24 so yeah I should we should get acne but uh, yeah I grew up with a lot of acne um even around my body so i have like really sensitive skin i woke up with like dry skin on my nose so it's it's just every day is a different day for my skin it really depends on how my skin is feeling every day and then uh my skin routine and everything changes according to how my skin feels okay that's it this is my skin prep um i think now we can get into my makeup Okay about makeup now. I I was a child actor. I started acting when I was 4 years old. So I've always been in the makeup chair. Um I've always had other people do makeup for me. Like I don't think I was 4 and I got makeup done. Like around 7 8 little makeup was always required. So I think I've really really 
I am passionate about makeup. I feel like if I was not an actor, I would have been a makeup artist. Um, I own a lot of makeup. I have like six big, big pouches of makeup, and I don't use them because there's always somebody else doing my makeup for me. And I, and another very like double standard thing is that I don't do makeup also. So I have a lot of makeup, and I barely put it. So it's just. So it's just lying there and i can't even give it away because i love it i love owning makeup so yeah that's that's what it is okay anyway so i will start with concealer okay my day to day look actually is very basic like i said i i barely do any makeup so usually if i have to go to a meeting or an audition i would just probably put a little concealer a little blush i'll curl my eyelashes and i'll i'm good to go uh but when sometimes i feel you know i have time i can do something more and i can make use of all the makeup that i have and not let my money go to waste i do a little uh, elaborative makeup which i will do for you today so i start with concealer i put a little here under my eyes and here yeah that's it and then i blend it off Cool. Oh this is this is an amazing brush it's PAC ka brush it's 221 and I think I use it for everything even for blush even for concealer for foundation sometimes for even eye shadow it's it's a it's it's a very well constructed brush I feel like I can do anything with it but like I said I like buying stuff so I need to use other brushes I'm like nahi nahi aur baki ki bhi use kar ehsaas <laughs> So yeah this is what I do on my nose my nose is a little dry today so it's going to be thoda patchy I don't know I woke up with dry skin around my nose and I'm like aaj hi aana tha It's literally that hota hai na ki wo whenever like you have a, like a big day or you have to go out or there's a red carpet or there's a party or there's something really important the other day you will find either a pimple on your face or dry skin patch randomly on your face and you're always like aaj hi hona tha so yeah this is what i do with my concealer sometimes i'm just like this and i put some powder and i'm just good to go but i'm not going to do that <laughs> so i am going to go into my um foundation okay this is fenty beauty uh this my makeup artist gifted because um like i said i had a lot of acne so my dermatologist said that i can't use oil based foundations so i was on a hunt for a water based foundation and this apparently is a water based foundation um and she gifted this to me and it's actually quite good because it blends really well it stays it's long lasting and it's not giving me any pimples so i put a little bit on my palette situation and then i will actually take the same brush and i will go a little on my face i'll go all around it uh actually like i said i've grown up doing makeup but i remember the first time i, I ever got like a proper glam makeup was by my mother She literally sat me down and she did my makeup for me. I think I was around seven, seven years old, and uh, she put kajal for me. She put um, liner for me. All, all the and I, I by then I did not have my own makeup, so I used. I remember I used to use her makeup till for the longest time till I was like fourteen, fifteen. I used to use her makeup. Uh, we used to share one. Uh, that's not healthy, guys. You shouldn't do that actually, ideally. But I used to use her makeup for auditions and stuff. and it was really cute so i actually owned my own makeup around 16 my own little makeup kit a pink makeup kit i remember i mean it's still pink but so yeah and she's the one who's actually properly taught me makeup ki kajal kaise lagate hain uh liner kaise lagate hain foundation kaise lagate hain uh and then obviously i've gotten tips from several makeup artists that i've worked with and i've been actually very lucky with all the makeup artists i've worked with because all of them are so nice and so loving but right now the makeup artist that i'm who's my soulmate makeup artist is called ritika she's amazing she's also a very good friend so shout out to her she's the one who gives me the best tips and 
yesterday when um, I was supposed to come for this, I was freaking out. I was calling her. I'm like, करना क्या होता है? कैसे करूँगी? ये कैसे करते हैं? वो कैसे करते हैं? She's like, you wing it. You do whatever you want. Just don't do a wing liner because you're going to make a mess out of yourself. तुम बेसिक रह क्या होगे? तो keep it basic, yeah. Let's let's keep it basic. Let's not do like a big big thing out of it. So I'm like, okay, basic रखते हैं. <laughs> Oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> This is my beauty blender. Uh, you are supposed to wet it, and then you're going. I, I love this. I love this part of it. When you wet it, and it's what for gold? I don't know what's the word. It's like really, it's so spongy. It's the best thing. Sometimes I don't even use it, but like I'm just like I just want to feel that. And yeah, I'm weird like that. But this is yeah, you know what I mean. So. But I think one very good tip is that once you're like completely done with your makeup, you're supposed to like dab your face with a with a wet sponge a little bit so that I don't know it settles the makeup down and it gives you a different glow. It's just it's magic. It's a trick that I've really not put logic into, but it genuinely works. Okay, I don't know what what do we do next? We do this. We do <laughs> powder. Okay, this is Elf ka perfect finish HD powder. It's It looks like this. Um, so basically, it's just like a transparent white powder. Uh, oh, did you see that? I see this. The, I, the, I see this happening in like videos, and I'm so fast. I can't believe I'm doing this today because I've seen this. I've, like I said, I've grown up watching these videos, and I'm so I'm so happy that I'm doing this today. I'm really nervous, also. So yeah. So you do this a little bit. I actually like a little glow. I don't like the matty matty face, so um, I put very less powder. Yeah, I think I did a good job. Yeah, no, okay, we'll find out. Uh, next thing that I do um, is okay. I'm not going to brag about it, but I'm also going to brag about it that I have really good eyebrows. I don't really really need to do them. Uh, I just brush them off, and I'm good to go. I have a slight cut here, though, oh, so I just fill that up. But I really don't like those those like really dark, thick eyebrows which go from here. I look very weird when that happens. Uh, I mean, Ritika knows this very well. But th when there's another makeup artist doing this, I have to like stop them and tell them, "Kid, don't go here." Like I forget sometimes. I'm sitting in my own zone, and then they go, "I'm like, ah, no, yahan se nahi, yahan se." <laughs> so. uh that is one thing that i that is my only actually that is my only uh note to every makeup artist to not start my eyebrows from here because i look very weird anyway so i brush them and that's it i'm done with my brows but some like i'll still cover this a little bit with a dark black eyeshadow and yeah that's it That's my eyebrows. Easy peasy. Okay. Now, um uh, I think I'm going to do a little bit of an eye shadow today. I usually don't do it, uh but today I'm feeling it. Uh this is a Tom Ford eye shadow. It's it's really nice and expensive. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm not subtle about it at all. Okay, don't expect me to be. <laughs> Yeah, so I go a little bit. It's ruined from inside. I'm not going to show you the halat of it because you all will judge me. It's just terrible. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take one shade. I'm gonna put it on my. Again, I have so many brushes, but I still use my fingers for eyeshadow. It's uncanny. I don't know what to do about myself. So I just go a little here. I'm wearing a pretty white dress today, so I feel like a little shimmer never hurt nobody. <laughs> so we can do a little shimmer. Yeah, this that that's it. Okay, okay, you have to blend it. Yeah, see, that's it. And then we don't take thoda extra. We just put that only on the other eye. Yeah, I'm not going to do anything else. Oh, you know what? I'm going to do this. Uh, Can somebody open this for me? <laughs> oh yeah, and sorry, I'm really sorry. Yeah. Oh, great. <laughs> Thank you. Again, I don't do any liner when if if it's a uh, day-to-day -day look or if I'm going for a 
meeting or an audition as long as the audition asks for it i don't do it so i usually just go with a kajal and lift my eye and i put some color okay i have really sensitive eyes even if like something touches my eye or even a little bit they start watering today is our lucky day because it's not happened yet okay, i'm just going to take this i think it just gives gives definition to your eyes if you put a little around here above but that's it this is all i'm going to do okay now the favorite part about my entire makeup routine is the eyelash curling part i feel like if i not do anything else to my eyes and i just curl them and i put a little mascara i am set and i'm good to go because this is the best invention ever made because it just lifts your eyes and it just gives you a different look you become a different person so i go and i lift my i i, I you know what my trick is and i don't recommend um uh, anyone doing this uh it's it's wrong it's a crime but i can do this even in a moving car yeah but that's my that's my talent okay you don't necessarily have it so you don't do it you might end up with no lashes at all so anyway i can do this and it's very very funny when you do this around men because they freak out they like oh ye kya kar rahe hai pagal ye nahi hai and then i go and do more it's it's crazy it's hilarious and i don't know one man in the world who does not get freaked out about it, except the makeup artists everybody else have just like and it's so weird like i'm talking talking and i'm like ha ye 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 and then do this and they're like what are you doing this is so creepy look look it just elevates the entire look and i love i love how my lashes look so this is it this i can i can just go on with my day and one thing that my makeup artist and i do uh, ritika and i do uh, just wo tuning itna acha baith gaya hai hamare beech mein so like when she's curling my and she's the only person who's allowed to curl my eyelashes because i trust her so when she's curling my eyelashes all she says is hmm and i say hmm which means ki are you okay is your skin okay is your skin not like pinching and i'm like yeah okay this is it this is my eyelashes and then i'll put a little bit of mascara this is maybelline ka mascara uh i always use a water resistant mascara and not a waterproof one uh because i feel like waterproof one are a little um difficult to remove and I, every time i'm like trying to take them off i have like one eyelash on my cotton pad Oh, which I really don't like. So I always go for a water-resistant one, um, and and you you're not supposed to cry or anything when you're wearing makeup. I'm like, है ना? No, I mean even if you cry, you will have it. But uh, that is something that you just have to deal with. I mean that is something that I deal with. But you know what? The funny thing is that I'm talking about waterproof. नहीं कि use करना चाहिए ये वो ये वो. And this is actually a waterproof mascara. I don't know where it came from, but this is a waterproof mascara. So चलो कोई नहीं. Today I will be secure, and I, we will figure out when we have to take the makeup off. So Rare Beauty has just launched. Um and the funny part is that before it was announced that it's launching in India, I. um i had a friend going to the us and i made her pick up a couple of stuff from rare beauty and then when she came back she gave it to me the next day it got announced and it's coming to me i'm like okay theek hai understood <laughs> so anyway so this she got and i've never used it actually this is probably the first time i'm going to use it so I'm, i was going through my makeup yesterday i was uh, curating my kit I'm like hmm I think this is a good occasion to use rare beauty today. I have grown up watching Selena Gomez and I love her. Um everything that she does. I remember when I was in school I used to listen to all her songs. I used to have her posters. Any time I saw her on a newspaper I used to cut it out, put it on my scrapbook. I was that crazy about her. And when she came up with this brand I was really really excited to use it. So I watched way too many videos to know that this is super pigmented. You're not supposed to use this a normal amount you're supposed to use like very little of it probably this much so i'm going to go yeah see it's already so pigmented i don't know how i'm going to look i'm going to look like an orange <laughs> so yeah now we blend it we blend it with this 
Brush. Okay, wish me luck. I'm scared. Huh, not bad. It's still very pigmented. Can you believe that? ये तो चलेगा अभी और दस पंद्रह साल क्योंकि अगर ऐसे ही use करेंगे तो खत्म ही नहीं होगा. But good, good strategy. I think she's she's very uh, she's thought of uh, you know makeup bu uh, budget friendly makeup where people don't have to buy the, her same products again and again. They can just this is very sustainable like that. I love it. Okay, this is it. This is what I do. No wait, blend it. This blend this a little more. Yeah. Sometimes I do like two um, two blushes. Like this is like a very peachy orangey blush, uh, which is here. And sometimes I go with another blush here. So I'm going to use another blush. This also, uh, you you don't have Nas in India yet. Um, so I got like this is actually a birthday gift. I really wanted a Nars ka something. I'm like, तुम जा रहे हो तो तुम कुछ तो लेके आओ नार्स का होना चाहिए बस मेरे को मेरी किट में नार्स दिखना चाहिए या आई एम दैट काइंड ऑफ पर्सन सो आई पुट अ लिटल ऑन द कैप ओनी बिकॉज आई सॉ दिस आई सॉ समी एल्स डूइंग दिस एंड आई वॉज वेरी फैसिनेटेड बाई इट दर इज नो लॉजिक टू इट बट आई जस्ट आई गेट इन्फ्लुएंस्ड बाई पीपल वेरी ईजीली सो आई सॉ समी एल्स डू दिस एंड आई एम आई डूइंग दिस सो आई गो ह्योर विद द नार्स अ लिटल Yeah, I'm very blushy today, but that's all right. I'm wearing a white dress, and uh, I've seen people do a lot of blush, and I think it's in, it's trending. A lot of blush on your face and on your nose is a thing, and it looks really nice. It gives you like this really plumpy, uh, cute, full, full look, which I really like. Okay, this is it. This is my makeup. and i'm going to put a little lipstick now and then we're going to go okay this is my favorite favorite lip pencil it's from mac it's called soar ha huh. soar this is called soar it's really natural and uh they look really really good on my lips yeah sometimes i just do this i put a lip balm and i'm good to go but i'm going to put a little bit of pinkish tint because we have pink um corally cheeks today so we're going to go for pink lips lip tint and then a lip oil this is again a very proud purchase it's the dior lip glow oil it's really it's fantastic i love it i barely use it because it's so it's so like valuable so i barely use it but i'm using it today ha ah, that's it this is my makeup look this is how i look i probably open my hair my frizzy hair today i'll wear my rings again we're done we're done with the makeup so we wear the rings again yeah this is it i'm so happy did i do a good job yeah. yes okay this is my final look uh this is my makeup this is my everyday um dewy uh simple makeup and one last step this is the byredo mohave ghost hair perfume um i was so thrilled that byredo is available in india there's one store in uh, geo drive bkc geo drive uh this smells heavenly so i put this and this is safe this is safe to use on your hair um and i'm i'm a okay one more thing i'm a biggie for perfumes i'm a biggie biggie for smelling good so i have perfume for my hair i have perfume for my clothes i have perfume for my skin um i just love smelling good it's just something about me and i love owning a lot of perfumes so this is one of them so the last step that i do is that i put little hair perfume on my hair that's it this is what i do so this was my everyday um skincare uh, makeup routine 
this is how I look when I do my own makeup. Uh, I look 10 times better when somebody else does my makeup. I promise you that. But this is it. I hope you liked it. I hope you liked every step. Yeah, please let me know in the comments below if uh, there's any tip or there's anything specifically that you liked. Um, I'm seeing all the comments. Thank you so much. I had too much fun.